Have you ever heard about the product backlog and the tea leaves effect? No? Let me explain it. If you like to drink a glass of tea or a cup of tea sometimes, a lot of people like that. And a lot of people have the situation where the little tea bag is torn, it's ripped. And you have these tea leaves floating in your tea. Well, that's not nice, right? So, and the funny effect is of the tea leaves in your tea is that once things calm down, you leave your tea alone, they go to the bottom. Once you stir your tea, you try to drink it, they come up again. So what you would typically do is get those tea leaves out because it's a sort of messy product. It's not what you like. It's not, it's not a clear product. It creates some sort of fog also in your tea. I advise people to do the same with their product backlog. Product backlog is a list of all things that somebody, certainly a product owner, thinks are useful or valuable for a product. You may have all those little things on your product backlog, like tea leaves. You think they're important, once you get work and, and, and you stir your product backlog, you go to work, they pop up. But you know, once you really are working and you calm down again, they drop to the bottom of your product backlog again. So, dear product owners, get those tea leaves out of your product backlog. All those little things that pop up and then sink again, get them out because they create a non-transparent product backlog. So product backlog and the tea leaves effect. Remove those little tea leaves from your product backlog. It will create a more transparent product backlog. And you know what? If those little things are really important, they will pop up again. Mm -hmm.